Are you buying Robux or Premium? Be sure to use star code B to support me, Dolly, and our channel. I've been getting a lot of comments on people recently telling me they absolutely love these overall outfits that I have been wearing in Royal High recently. So today, you guys, I'm going to teach you how to make these overall outfit hacks and how you can look as awesome as possible wearing overalls in-game. Hey wonderful little beans, my name is Mia, welcome back to another video. Before we get started, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe and click that bell so you never miss any of my daily Royal High content. And of course, don't forget to use stack of B when buying Robux or Premium. You guys, these outfit hacks are so cute and we definitely suggest you guys to check them out if you want to. So that you can wear something super, super cute and awesome in the game without having to wear a skirt or a dress. Absolutely, you guys. These are definitely more different types of outfits than what you might be used to in Royal High. But I'm going to walk you through a tutorial of how to create this anyways. So what you're going to need to do, you guys, obviously, is we're going to reset here so we can start off from the beginning. And we'll take off all of our UGC items, of course, to start off with. So what you're going to want to do, first things first, head on into the heels section, you guys. And you're going to go down to the Monterey Tea Party platforms. Now, you can probably use other heels too. I know the loafers and things like that do work still, even though they have the big floofy bit at the bottom. But the most effective ones that I personally have found are the Monterey Tea Party heels. Then you're going to want to pick a texture. The brown one I was using before, the reason for that brown one being used was because it was actually the texture that I have in a pair of real life overalls that I have, you guys. So that's why I picked that. But if you want to go ahead and choose any texture you like, it can be jean texture. Some people have been doing the jean fabric style. You want it to probably be a match fabric not one that has say different edges around it because you want it to like fit with the overalls at the top if that makes sense that actually looks like a pair of overalls so maybe a fabric where it's all one color or the same repeating pattern for example basically things like that so we go ahead and pick one let's go with um i'm gonna go with this one you guys like the dark brown plaid pattern oh actually strawberries we're gonna go strawberries just for fun so then you've got to make sure your shoes are either a dark brown, you guys, or a black. If you're going for a lighter color one, I would suggest like a lighter color pants or texture. I would suggest maybe going for brown shoes instead of black shoes. That is up to you there. And then obviously you can go ahead and put the markings on the side if you want to. I suggest actually making those markings the same as the texture you're using so that everything matches. But that's up to you. Once you've done that, obviously you have your shoes. And that's it, you guys, for the shoes, for the lower legs. That's all you need to do. The next step, you guys, is to go and get your body. So now you can use a different torso. There are a few that work. But the gothy cutie one is the most effective, in my opinion, because of these straps. So you're going to go ahead and you're going to grab the top part here. So click top and chill and select the same texture you are using for the bottoms. Now, obviously, this is close to overalls, but you can see it's not quite connecting. So then in the necklace and chains, set them to whatever color you want those to be, the necklaces, etc. I'm going to go ahead and make them, let's see, let's make them like a pink color, maybe. Then the undershirt, you guys, you're going to want, instead of coloring it, you're probably going to want to color the undershirt the same color as your skin or as close to your skin as possible. And then on the fishnets, well, you can kind of pick what you want to do here you guys i've been going for black and just leaving them black because i just think it looks nice but it's up to you some people have done like skin color to try and hide them as well it's quite hard to skin color the fishnets there so that is up to you then you need to go into your body model section body types royal and make sure you've got the woman with girl legs on because then it will connect the pieces together the woman one does work as well as you can see but with a slight gap underneath so i choose the woman with girl legs because it just seems to connect everything nicer but the woman one makes you a bit taller and a bit less um I don't know, just kind of a little bit short, I guess. It doesn't really matter either way, you guys. As long as you've got one of those two selected, it will connect your bits together. As you can see, there's no gap here. And then, obviously, you'll go about your usual dress-up after that. So, obviously, you can go ahead and put on a face. So, I'll go find my current favorite face, you guys. If you type in freckles, and then these cute freckles by Kitzilla are the ones I've been using the most recently. I really love those. Then obviously head into your hairstyle, grab whatever you want, whether it's like the braids or whatever. As you guys can see, I've been using kitty ear bangs, but we'll take those off for now. And then I would suggest that you guys also go into your warp packs, maybe change the delicate by Jam Jam Jew. It's up to you though. I just really hate the default warp packs. Then as you guys can see, we have created a very accurate looking set of overalls. So you can see it actually looks like proper 
overalls you guys and i really really like that it looks like a one-piece suit now some people have said that you can make it look like a pinafore dress with certain skirts i have tried and struggled and not managed to actually do it you guys i'm wondering if maybe with the pleated skirt you could potentially do it as you guys know you can get um things that i like to wear in real life i don't wear overalls you guys might see me wearing pictures that look like overalls they're actually not overalls you guys what i'm wearing in those pictures are actually um pinafore dresses which means they're like overalls but they're dress instead and then on this though you guys you probably need to color the undershirt too to be the same if you want to be able to use a skirt because otherwise it's not going to connect properly but then it does look a little bit strange up here at the top so you've got to kind of consider what you want to do with this one you guys personally I just don't know if it works as well, but it can. I guess you just have to improvise and see how it goes. Some people have suggested using December's dream shoes so you can make them into actual pants instead. Now, I have to admit, you guys, I haven't actually tried this. So let's go ahead and have a look. Some people have suggested it. I don't know if it works because the waist on this is a lot lower down. But let's go ahead and change it to the trousers. So that's those, isn't it? Um... There we go. We've got the trousers on. And then let me set the body back again to the correct body type because the bodies seem to break a lot. Let's see. Yeah, you do kind of get a gap because of the fishnets. So I just don't know if that would work. I think if you wanted to have pants on, the only way you could do it is if the undershirt and the fishnets were both coloured as well. And I don't really know how that would look. Let's go ahead and have a look, you guys, real quick. Let's set those to the same colour. I mean, it looks connected, but barely. Right, and I don't know, your proportions just look kind of odd. I don't know, I personally just think the proportions look kind of odd. Now, obviously, I created this outfit before, which obviously is intended it had to look nice. It has the overalls, like a pinafore dress that I have in real life, but overalls instead, since it's hard to create the pinafores. And I just think it looks really, really nice, you guys. So these overall outfits are just super cute, in my opinion. A lot of people have been saying to me how cute they think they are. And I really thought I would like these, and I actually really do. And to be honest, you guys, actually originally, I wasn't sure if I would, because I'm normally quite over the top of the dresses that I wear. But these are super cute outfits. I love how modern they look, and less royal they look, and more realistic they look. And I just thought that if, since a lot of you guys have been saying you like them, maybe I would share with you how I did it. So let me know in the comments down below if you like these you guys go ahead and create some yourself see what you think i definitely think it's becoming popular at the moment among people to create the jean fabric ones if i go ahead and show you really quick like let's go for like the um we'll go for the light jeans for this one just as an example, if you go ahead and set the jean fabrics, you can see it looks like jean overalls that you're wearing. It looks really good, you guys. It does work really well. And personally, I am really impressed by how nice it looks. I don't know. Now, this side part with the hearts, you can leave it if you want to with the hearts shirt if you want. Or, of course, you can go ahead and set that to the fabric as well. That's not the right one. That's the shoes. Set that to the fabric as well. And then the shoes need to be black. There we go. So if you go ahead and set that aside, look, it'll just be like one solid piece, you guys, instead. And I just I just really like this, you guys. It just seems like a really cute outfit hack. And personally, I think you guys will really enjoy it. So let me know what you think in the comments down below, you guys. I'm always interested in your ideas and thoughts on these things. Let me know if you're going to create any outfits like this. Tweet me at bplaysrblx or tag me on Instagram at bplays. If you do make an outfit like this, I would love to see it. Thanks for watching, everyone. I'll see you on the next video. Have a great day. Goodbye.